Hey everyone, just wanted to create a quick screencast to show you how to set up the crowd layers service. If you wanted to look at your annotations or the annotations of our group in a slightly different way, uh, crowd layers is a service on the web. So we'll need that URL and you're also going to need your <clears throat> hypothesis account. So uh, we'll use the uh, hypothesis account login as well. So start by going to the crowd layers uh, website. And uh, when you go there, you've got the uh, basic web page. There's no data populated as part of that web page yet. Uh, so what we have to do is enable it uh, as linked to our uh, hypothesis account. So the way you can do that is if you select groups, uh, it doesn't have any groups by default, but you can enter a, a little token, which is basically like a password to allow this service to access your hypothesis data. So I'm going to hop over to Hypothesis, and the way to get your token is to just go into Settings and Developer. And there's your string of text. Make sure you have it all and copy it. And if you pop that in to CrowdLayers, it should then uh, bring up any groups you're associated with. So I've got the 569 group. If I select that, I'll now be able to see uh, the data for our group. And uh, just gives you another way to look at the annotations that we've done so far, uh, some basic uh, dashboard analytics and um, activity over time. So we're doing really well so far, and I hope we keep uh, going with this. Uh, we'll get past any problems uh, that those have been having, and um, hopefully it's working well for you. Uh, if you have any questions, just um, drop me a comment or uh, reach out to me, and uh, I'll be happy to support.